Aber ich hole schon mal auf die Bühne. Ein Applaus für Roland Dantes. So, um, Master Roland, can you tell us about the work that you do in the Philippines and what is the significance, especially the Irish Council and everything? Uh, first, uh, good evening to you all. Uh, good in heaven. Uh, yes, I'm very, very happy to be here. Actually, this is my second time here in Germany. Uh, it's about uh, almost two years ago when uh, that to Dieter invited me, and I'm just amazed uh, at this. I've never seen a martial arts crowd like this. Never before, and I'd like to congratulate uh, the host, uh, the two hosts, uh, Datu Dieter Nuttall and uh, Albert Platt, for put your hands together again for the team guys. Fantastic how they they've uh, put this together, and I can see all the, the folks are enjoying here. On behalf of the uh, Philippines. I just arrived uh, last night, very late, about half past twelve, and Dieter was there at the airport, and I was, he's so tired, and this guy is just enormous with his drive. You know, we, we came in here, we, we passed him, the stage was just being fixed and put together. Uh, these guys are, uh, even from the security and all his, his friends, his people, they all joined and united themselves to put this together. And for all of them, I take my hat off to them because I've never seen an organization like this so professionally done. Thank you. That's all. Yes. yourself as a star or as the, the, uh, the master but also always as a medium to trans transfer the Filipino martial arts and, um, and I've very rarely seen such a humble person as you are and we are very deeply touched that you that you are here and, and we feel very honored um, that you take the time to be at our festival our special guest star thank you thank you, thank you. <laughs> thank you very much thank you yes. This is surprising me, seeing myself there. I don't know how long that was. Because... About two years ago. <laughs> <laughs> See, I, I just turned uh, 62 years old this year. So to me, looking at that, yes. seems like ages. So, uh... If you would take off your shirt, we wouldn't see any difference. <laughs> <laughs> uh, it's such a good shape. I, I'm just amazed. I just amazed at what Dieter has done for the art too. Because, uh, you know, I met Dieter 1981. 83. 83? <laughs> See, my memory, memory now <laughs> dates back. 
And the Department of Tourism called me and he said, Roland, uh, there's a German tourist here in Manila and he's a student and he's doing, doing a research on the Filipino martial arts. So uh, could you help us with this student? Because he was in college then, Dieter was a young man, he was, he came in, Long time came ago. in there, <laughs> tall kid, you know, and I said, oh, he wanted to learn and study the Filipino martial arts. And there, his research, you know, never stopped ever since. I introduced him to different masters. He studied the art from different styles. And, you know, I look at him putting all this beautiful MM FMA festival right here in Dortmund. But this is of 2004. But this God. stage is up for you now, not for me. <laughs> That's well, what I mean, with a humble man, you know? I know. It's for you. Tell us a little bit about the Arnest Bill that's passed the... Yes. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, you know, this year, just about uh, four months ago, the Philippine Congress passed a bill called the Arnest Bill. Also, das yes. Arnest Gesetz ist durch den Philippinischen Kongress gegangen yes. vor vier Monaten? Yes. All these years, Arnest has only been an elective physical education okay. subject, meaning you can take it or you don't have to take it. That was how it was. And because of this, it's a very good timing that Dieter has put this festival together because with the Arnis Bill, it will require both public and private schools in the Philippines to make it mandatory. In other words, compulsory for all schools to have it as a required physical education subject in all levels from grade six up to college. You did a lot of lobby work that this bill came through. Thank you, Roland. Yes, sir. Thanks for the uh, Next year, there will be an international festival and congress in the Philippines. And I'd like to invite you all, starting from Dato Dieter to Alfred Flat, come to the Philippines. You enjoy yourselves. Don't uh, believe sometimes journalism they said it's dangerous there no it is not it's not as dangerous as what they say anywhere in the world there are dangerous places and bad places and all that but generally the world the philippines is peaceful the festival will be there in right in manila we welcome you and southeast asian games will be hosted by the philippines next year you're invited that will be sometime the last week of November to the first week of December. So come over, have a holiday, okay? You, you'll enjoy yourselves, plus the festival and the Philippine martial arts. And very good timing. See how Dr. Dieter and uh, Alfred Platt has put this together. I was just talking to our uh, uh, vice consul uh, earlier, Ed over there, who gave you a speech. And uh, on behalf of the Philippine government and our Miss Philippines, which is the 33rd member of the Philippine Olympic Committee. Thank you very much for sharing this art of, and propagating it is right here, not only in Germany, but all over Europe. So again, thank you very much, and I hope you enjoy your stay uh, with the uh, festival. And tomorrow yet, there will be more seminars. Uh, and imagine how we invited all of this. I can't help it say it over again. From the United States to Mexico, we even had from uh, from Greece. Uh, can you imagine putting this all together here for you all folks? So hang in there. Don't uh, don't go home because there's a lot more to see here to enjoy. And tomorrow, if you have time, come over. You can see all the masters teaching. So again, thank you, Dank Dank uh, Shen. Good good and good to have them. God bless you all. Thank you.